here binds the world Forgiveness sets it free Forgiveness sets it free Fear binds the world Forgiveness sets it free Forgiveness sets it free Binds the world, forgiveness sets it free. Forgiveness sets it free. Fear binds the world, forgiveness sets it free. Forgiveness sets it free. Forgiveness sets it free. Undo illusions, evil dreams by shining them away. Forgiveness bids this present center in, take its rightful place within the mind. Take its rightful place. Binds the world, forgiveness sets it free. Forgiveness sets it free. Fear binds the world, forgiveness sets it free. Forgiveness sets it free. Set it free, light will shine through all your darkened dreams, allowing freedom to find its way. Allowing freedom fear binds the world. Forgiveness sets it free. Forgiveness sets it free. Fear binds the world. Forgiveness sets it free. Forgiveness sets it free. Fear binds the world. Forgiveness sets it free. 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 Lesson 332 from A Course in Miracles. Fear binds the world. Forgiveness sets it free. The ego makes illusions. Truth undoes its evil dreams by shining them away. Truth never makes attack. It merely is. And by its presence is the mind recalled from fantasies, awaking to the real. Forgiveness bids this presence enter in and take its rightful place within the mind. Without forgiveness is the mind in chains, believing in its own futility. Yet with forgiveness does the light shine through the dream of darkness, offering it hope and giving it the means to realize the freedom that is its inheritance. We would not bind the world again today. Fear holds it prisoner, and yet your love has given us the means to set it free. Father, we would release it now, for as we offer freedom, it is given us, and we would not remain as prisoners while you are holding freedom out to us.
binds the world Forgiveness sets it free Forgiveness sets it free Fear binds the world Forgiveness sets it free Forgiveness sets it free Binds the world, forgiveness sets it free. Forgiveness sets it free. Fear binds the world, forgiveness sets it free. Forgiveness sets it free. Forgiveness sets it free. Undo illusions, evil dreams by shining them away. Forgiveness bids this present center in, take its rightful place within the mind. Take its rightful place. Binds the world, forgiveness sets it free. Forgiveness sets it free. Fear binds the world, forgiveness sets it free. Forgiveness sets it free. Set it free Light will shine Through all your darkened dreams Allowing freedom To find its way Allowing freedom Fear binds the world Forgiveness sets it free Forgiveness sets it free Fear binds the world Forgiveness sets it free Forgiveness sets it free Fear binds the world Forgiveness sets it free Forgiveness sets it free Binds the world, forgiveness sets it free. Forgiveness sets it free. Forgiveness sets it free. Now for the reflection on lesson 332. What a simple and obvious equation this is. The ego makes illusions. Truth undoes its evil dreams. How? By shining them away. Just like a shadow. A shadow is nothing more than an object that blocks the light and then casts a darkened spot onto the ground. And if we had our back to the light facing the shadow, we might, if we were insane, believe that that shadow is a real thing. Look, it moves. It, it seems to have interactions with other shadows. But it is only when we turn around toward the light that we realize what is happening. And then we stop blocking it. We no longer block the light within us. And what happens? The shadow is gone. For the truth has shined it away. It has no need to be cast upon the ground because that which seemed to create it has been removed now. The block to the awareness of love. This is what Jesus says at the very beginning of the course. And he says over and over in a very gentle, loving way, you're insane. 
hate to tell you this, but you are completely insane because you are perceiving a world that is not there. That is the definition of insanity. And yet we've convinced ourselves so completely, so radically, that that is not true, that this is a very real world, and that the interactions that I have are real interactions. And yet now I know, through this course, through this experience of light, that this is not the real world, that if I turn around, there is no more need for this shadow, for the ego, to be cast upon the ground, thinking that it is real. The world disappears as I know it. And the real world is seen, even in this moment. And so this is what the Course brings us to over and over again. Let this be the day. I know I say that a lot. Let this be the day. But let this be the moment, the very moment that you decide to turn around, face the light, and see what it is that you have been missing all this time.